For 14 families near Pound, Wisconsin, May 18, 1991 was a historic day. It's the day we got our mail delivered. You see, most of us are retired. Several are widowed and we have an elderly handicapped couple. We receive medication by mail and shop by catalog instead of driving two hours to the nearest shopping center. The problem was the post office wouldn't deliver our mail. We had to drive six to 10 miles to pick it up. It was especially bad in the winter when driving was dangerous and packages were exposed to rain and snow. We were supposed to get our mail delivered, but for over 10 years, the bureaucrats ignored us. We had almost given up. Then we wrote Herb Cole. He cut through the red tape and forced the bureaucrats to listen. Now we get our mail like everyone else. Around here, we're pretty high on Herb Cole. A lot of senators talk a good game, but here in Pound, we know Herb Cole delivers. Herb Cole, nobody's senator but yours. As a young man, he worked stocking shelves and sweeping up in his parents' grocery store. And over the years, he helped build a few neighborhood stores into one of the most successful businesses in Wisconsin. Cole's stores were known for honesty and decency, an attitude that started with an open office door and a man the employees called Herb. Until 1962, when we opened up our first apartment. He headed the United Way, bought the Milwaukee Bucks to keep them from moving and established a scholarship program with his own funds to reward Wisconsin's best teachers and help students pay for college. I'm so pleased with the job Herb Cole is doing. Herb Cole said today, the time for talk is over. Only this year got the Senate and the House to agree uh, to require that every handgun be sold with a safety device. We call it a trigger lock. Well, the idea is to uh, allow smaller companies around the country, of which Wisconsin has plenty of them, to band together. And in coming together, they're able to negotiate a uh, you know, much better price than if they were trying to get health care alone, whether it be an individual farmer, for example, or a small business owner. He's the only one who's ever proposed anything like this or come forward with some type of money instead of just standing back there and jaw jacking and saying, this is what we should do. Herb Cole, nobody's senator but yours. Herb, Herb has made a tremendous impact on sports in the state of Wisconsin. Uh, here, uh, very uh, instrumental in us building the Cole Center. I want to say how proud I am of all the soldiers at home and abroad who serve our country with honor. I want you to know that we understand the sacrifices you make on a daily basis in order to protect our country. To our soldiers based overseas, especially those from Wisconsin, we are proud of you and please know that you are in our thoughts today and all year long. and I rise today for one final time to address the Senate. It has been the greatest honor of my life to serve these 24 years in this hallowed institution alongside my fellow senators and my staff and as the voice for the people of Wisconsin. For that, I thank you all one last time and I yield the floor. <laughs>